Hello there, you're welcome again and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can add payment mode to your Courseify account and at the same time, how you can add blog to your e-learning platform. Now, let's get started. Now, you come to the sidebar and navigate downward. You click on settings and you come to payment settings right here. You click on payment settings. So here is the interface where you have to set up your payment information and you ensure that the system currency and all active payment gateway currencies are same. All right. Now you pick the system currency that you want to use. Okay. I pick USD and the currency position where you want the currency to actually appear, probably left or right as the case may be, or left with a space, you know, left. Now, once you do that, you click on update system currency and it will be updated. Now you scroll down again. Now, if you are using PayPal, you have to do your settings under PayPal settings right here. All right. Now this is active, right? You have to ensure that it's, it's yes. All right. To make sure that your PayPal is actually active. Click on yes. Once you keep test mode enabled, you can pick no, that you don't want it to be a test mode or you pick yes as the case may be all right you select your currency it is usd so you have to ensure that the system currency settings are actually the same all right so when you come right here you must ensure that the currency you're picking for these paypal settings is also usd all right all right because when you get here now you don't have to pick any other currency apart from usd so that this usd this currency which is usd tallies with this system currency all right now let's move on you also have the sandbox client id you copy it and paste it right here you paste your sandbox client id right here then again you have to ensure that you copy your paypal secret key all right and you paste it right here all right you paste it right here and once you do that you enter your production client id right here okay and your production secret key right here and once you're done with this you come right here click on update paypal settings and your settings will be updated and if you're using stripe you just scroll down and you come right here to adjust the setting all right and you also ensure that the select currency is usd and that it does not contradict the system currency right here that is very very important all right so that's it it's very simple and straightforward all right and now for your blog in order to add blog to your e-learning platform you come right here you click on blog you see all blogs pending blog blog category and blog settings now you click on all blogs right here so you navigate to add new blog so you follow sonia right here the ai virtual assistant chatbot you know you select category you pick this what's the blog about let's say fashion let's say it's about fashion then you generate blog Click. and here you go the blog has been generated you see the content right here these are the keywords you have the title right here fashion forward the latest trends and styles right then you have the description here and the blog banner all right and you can also upload your blog thumbnail right here if you want to do that right you just click here to choose a thumbnail pick your thumbnail and you click on open and it comes up right here for you all right you can mark as popular then you click on add blog and the blog has been added to your e-learning platform so it's as easy as that there is no stress if you want to add more blogs you click on add new blog again and you're gonna have it all right now let us check our e-learning platform and see if the blog will appear right there now you preview here you go now this is the e-learning platform and let's go to the blog section right 
and uh, here is the fashion blog that we just added to our e-learning platform so that's it it's as simple as that now thank you very much see you again in the next video